This is how to fix Rogue Ally SD card reader. Let's say for example, you have popped in the top an SD card or you already had one that might not be functioning correctly or it doesn't show up in Windows Explorer. What you can do is this method to fix it. Go to the bottom left, to the Windows icon, search for Disk Management This is the option you should be pressing. Once you're in here, even though you will not see your SD card in Windows Explorer, you should see it over here as removable. This should be it. Keep this long press. Hit Delete Volume. Select Yes. Now, reactivate the volume. New simple volume. We're like recreating the SD card entity. Next. This is like the whole space that should be all of it selected. This is like the letter you want it to be associated with. You can choose it from here. And make sure to choose from here from this drop down NTFS format. Okay. If you want to name the volume a certain way, you can name it here and click next and finish. Wait a bit for it to reactivate. You can see here on the bottom right that it has been now reactivated. Then go to your Windows Explorer. Go to this PC. If it is not accessible from here, then you might need to format it again in order to reactivate it. Please keep in mind though that the Rogue Ally is known to have SD card reader issues from the get-go. The slot itself is faulty because it is placed next to the cooling vent. So it might have been damaged due to high heat. What you can extra do to know if it is broken completely, you can put the same SD card in another SD card reading device and if the SD card works there, then it means that there is a problem with your ROG Ally. Now you know how to fix Rogue Ally SD card reader.